Hello again and welcome to another video tutorial for Lavinia Stamps. I'm Lisa Taggart and I'm calling this creation The Gathering. I had a lot of fun doing this one and uh, as you can see it uses some firm favourites from recent stamp releases but also we've got two or three brand new stamps. Uh, these were featured on the craft store show recently and uh, I'm going to use uh, as usual a number of mixed media techniques and layering. So I hope you can join me today and I'd very much appreciate it if you would consider subscribing to Inky Bliss Creations YouTube channel if you haven't already done so and also of course the channel at Lavinia Stamps. So without further ado, let's get started and look at the materials used. So first up we have the ink sprays and we have uh, Dirty Martini and Peony in the Dilutions. We have a couple of lovely uh, mica sprays from Lindy's Gang in purple and a peachy pink. We have the yellow uh, from uh, Inks and this is a lovely bright colour. We also have our permanent ink pads for stamping and blending. We have Nocturne. We have Shady Lane. The lovely Purple Delight. Monarch. Cheerful, which you can hardly see, <laughs> and verdant finally. We also have pan pastels and a couple of pearlescent ones to begin with the yellow and then the red. Moving on then to the beautiful bright yellow green and the very versatile violet. I'm also going to use a Distress Ink uh, Seedless Preserves. And in terms of the pencils, first of all, we have a couple of chalk pastel pencils in white and yellow and the Stabilo All in black. We have the uh, white Signo uh, gel pen and the same again in yellow. We have our glitter pens in pink and gold. We're also using water-based um, colouring markers in pink, purple, fluorescent yellow and green. Of course a bit of sparkles, so we have lime green stickles and I also find this lovely one, it's a Martha Stewart glitter and it's a beautiful pink colour. We're using the Lavinia Acetate Hill Masks in this project which have come in very handy and of course some of the beautiful brushes to go along with those. Um, I've got my yellow dirty so I'm using a different brush for yellow. Uh, we have the water pen and of course the applicators for the pan pastels. In terms of tools we have a smoothie and we have the putty eraser for removing the pastel and I just have then the circle template that I tend to use but any circle template will do. In terms of the stamps this is a lovely set of stamps today. We have this lovely fox from the fox set, fox set one, the forest hairs which are new and the tree of hope and tree of courage the forest creeper which is also new and then the lovely siren so uh, a really delightful combination today so let's get started
So my friends, there you have it. That's the finished project and it uh, uses some lovely warm colours and there's been plenty of scope to create a uh, focal point and light, uh, which I enjoy. Um, it's also very twinkly, uh, as usual. <laughs> so um, as you can see, it's mounted and framed onto cream and black. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you've enjoyed the project. Please take care of yourselves and I'll see you again. Somehow, somehow.